the two witnesses and the three days of death. As the 144K are overcome by the beast, as stated in Revelation chapter 11, those witnesses lay dead in the streets for three days. During those days, sorry, I got distracted by my cat. The two witnesses and the three days of death as the 144,000 are overcome by the beast as stated in Revelation chapter 11 those witnesses lay dead in the streets for three days during those days they will be with the Lord beneath below the altar in Abraham's bosom as a day is a thousand years with the Lord these witnesses for Christ bear the truth to those who are in Sheol who did not hear it before as everyone will need to hear the truth before the kingdom comes this will be those lost souls final chance to be with God by accepting Jesus Christ to save their souls from the second death these in Sheol will face the wrath of God for still disobedience still for disobedience but be granted a way to save their souls from the second death by hearing the truth and not selling it, but by buying the truth and wisdom and instruction and understanding. The believers save them. They sa the this saves the this saves them from the lake of fire. The believers at the final judgment of God. The dead who believed on Jesus will rise from the dead first and be held outside the gates, weeping and gnashing their teeth to await judgment for their works. Revelation chapter 20. As all whose names are in the Lamb's book of life will enter into the king enter into the kingdom enter into the kingdom at judgment day. And those not whose names are not written in the book will enter the lake of fire for this is the love story of God. Shalom.